Hi everyone, so final video review for this week is for The Long Shot by A.L. Brooks, which was my third um, ARC review copy from Ilva Publishing uh, for August. If you want to check out my Goodreads review, I have just posted that, so if you're on Facebook or if you're on the blog post, there is a link in the post. And if you're on YouTube, there's a link in the description below, so you can go and check that out. And like I said, this is a video review for The Long Shot by A.L. Brooks. And oh my god, you guys, I fell in love with this book, like seriously fell in love with it. It was so amazing, oh my god, I'm still not over it. I finished it and I'm like, I know I need to read next week's books and I'm like, I don't want to yet. I haven't finished loving this book. Um, A.L. Brooks is one brilliant writer, like seriously. When I read her very first book that I, that I read, which was Up on the Roof, I just knew I was gonna love her stuff and everything I've read since has like topped that first book that I read and then like, I don't think things could top some of these books and then every time she releases a new book it tops the last book that I told her I absolutely loved and then like I don't know how she does this but they're just brilliant um so this is a sports romance which is something different again from A.L. Brooks like it's completely different and I'm not a sporty person right anyone who knows me knows that I'm, I'm rubbish at sports I don't watch them I don't do sport I don't I don't support anything I'm you know I'm involved in a local football club but that's because I volunteer doing the bar you know I don't I don't do sport, I don't do it, I don't follow it, I don't care about it, I don't know the rules, nothing. But sports romances in this lesbian genre are absolutely fantastic and I am kind of in love with them. And so, I never thought I'd say this, but I'm a little bit in love with, with golf now. So, yay! But I'm still not going to watch it on TV, but I will read this book again. Like, I swear to God, I love it so much. Um, so it follows the story of Morgan, who is on the cusp of winning her first major golf tournament. and she is quite a shy and private person uh, and then she finds herself needing to be a little bit more public um, to get a little bit more support and her agent decides that a great thing for her to do would be part of this television uh, production that Adrian, um, Adrienne, I should say it properly shouldn't I? It sounds really common saying like that. Adrienne, who is a television producer, um, is eager to document the success of Morgan as she goes through this journey to hopefully winning her first um, major golf tournament and so this is this makes Morgan uncomfortable um, but she agrees to do it and I'm telling you she gets so much more than she bargained for and she's so lucky as well um, so this also um, gets lots and lots of stars and points because it's an age gap romance and we all know that the first thing I will trip over my feet to get my hands on is an age gap romance oh my god they are my thing like I love them um so yeah sport age gap mix it together oh we're teaching me something new we're giving me something I love I'm so happy um so she's not really keen on the idea Morgan she's not really keen on the idea of having everything filmed and having these people around her but she she reluctantly agrees and she gets a lot more than she bargained for when she gets to know Adrienne a little bit better um, and it just so happens that she's kind of a little bit attracted to her when she sees her for the very first time before she even knows who she is. Um, so of course that, she's, she was on a hiding to nothing Morgan wasn't she? She was destined to um, be part of this and experience everything she goes through in this story. Um, but seriously like every time I read Danae Brooks it becomes my new favourite book and this book yeah this is my new favourite book and I have literally fallen in love with it, I am not joking. I This book is just everything to me. I had the most emotional and immense time reading it and I didn't want to put it down and I didn't want it to end and it ended and I'm not okay and so I'm going to have to go back and read it like sometime real soon. Um, I could never have imagined when I picked up a book about golf that I was going to feel the way I did reading it. Like seriously, you don't have to like golf to love this book. I am telling you that now. You will learn something about golf reading this book and you will learn something about lots of things reading this book. Um, but yeah, you will love it. I am telling you now. If age gap is your thing, this is perfect for you. If age gap isn't your thing and you're looking for something new to read, this is also your thing. Go read this. This is amazing. Um, I'm just a little bit in awe with just how this book makes me feel. Like seriously, I can't really tell you. I can't even, like, you can see it radiating off me. I am just like in love with this book. I so love it so very much. And I really didn't think A.L. Brooks could do better than write your own script. And then, then she comes along with the long shot and bam, you know, I'm, oh, I'm just like, oh my God, I love it. Um, So 
yeah I'm just completely addicted to the story I couldn't put it down and that that relationship between Morgan and Adrian was amazing because it was like forbidden romance as well and it was just like oh there was so much complication and so you know the underlying themes supporting this romance were really thrilling like they were tension filled and there was a lot going on and um, it showed true reflections of how some people perceive um, and behave towards women just women in general and then how they you know even how they behave other women as well like how they behave towards women and then you know it was all handled so sensitively um, but also that chauvinistic way that most sports are male driven and even golf you know even Morgan with her own dad was having trouble and so it was just really well put into this book and it added extra depth and extra drama to the whole story and it was amazing when you see that conflict between Morgan and her dad you will know exactly what I'm talking about and it was portrayed perfectly like literally perfectly I'm telling you that stuff goes on like you know it does and it was just absolutely fantastically portrayed like you couldn't have done it better never ever ever have I related to characters in the way I did to Morgan and Adrian? Like, they just, age gap, and their age gap was like, it was totally like, just, it really reminded me of something I experienced and I'm experiencing myself. And I just, oh my God, I wish like me and my Adrian were like, forward enough to, to like these two were so brave and, like it was amazing that their, their emotions and everything were just brilliant and I just saw so much of my own hang-ups in Morgan um, and I identified with many of the same in Adrian as well even though you know she was perceived from the older perspective the older one in the relationship with the age gap um, yeah I do I totally get where both characters were coming from and where both their their hang-ups and holding back and all that came from all those emotions and feelings and yeah I yeah I know why some people hold back and Adrian I Adrian I totally understood why Adrian held back as much as she did and fought as long as she could because age gaps are complicated not only for the two people involved but for people around them families everything um and so it was really brilliantly put together that's all I can say brilliant it was absolutely fantastic and you know this made the characters so very real for me and they both kind of stole a little piece of my heart <laughs> um they're like literally they're my favorite like if there was a power couple like for like oh yeah it would be Morgan and Adrian for me right now I just absolutely love them um so this book, like, it's an A.L. Brooks. If that doesn't already scream at you that you should read this book, then I am telling you to go and read this book. Like, it's amazing. Literally, it's brilliant. Like, I can't say more than that. And the perfect age gap romance, and it's up there now with one of my all-time favourite lesbian books. It just spoke to me on so many levels, and I'm telling you, if age gap is your thing, this is your book. This is your new, like heaven you will love it it's a brilliant brilliant book and i really hope we do see more from morgan and adrian in the future because i miss them already and i want more please um but yeah i loved it i absolutely loved it so i'll pop a link in the description so that you can go and grab a copy because i keep telling you you need to read it which means you need a link so that you can go and find where to buy it because you need to buy it i'm definitely buying myself a paperback copy because it looks amazing and i love it so much um yeah so go and grab yourselves a copy if you've read the long shot by al brooks please 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 come and talk to me about it what did you love about it how amazing was it come and talk to me about it and if you haven't read it yet or if it's on your to read list or you're now really interested in reading it please 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 get in touch let me know let me know when you plan on reading it as well because then you can come back and you can talk to me about how amazing it was <gasps> i can't wait and if you do grab a copy of it i really 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 hope you love it as much as i did bye